Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. Our next guest is known as the No Nonsense Standout Star. Look at that. No Nonsense <laughs> Standout Star on the hit TV show TMZ. And now she's taken her popularity to new heights. First with her own YouTube show, yes, and girl. now her brand new talk show on BET called Rock. Rack. It's rack, right? No, rack, 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 rack rants. Rack rants. Please welcome. Rack rants. Rachel rack. Harper. Get it right. Rack Harper. Rack Harper. Rack Harper. We don't get my name right, okay? <laughs> Raquel Harper. Yes. Raquel Harper. Yes. <laughs> How are you, ma'am? Yes. Yes. So yes. happy to be here. Yes, we are very happy for you to be here as well. We love it. We love it. We love it. Uh, we know from TMZ that you are very opinionated uh -huh. on everything. What would be your biggest story that you've broken? I mean, well, honestly, I break tons of stories every day. Um, yes. But I broke probably recently a big one, Cardi B's pregnancy. Mm -hmm. ah, so that, that was some good one. tea. Mm -hmm. That was some good tea. tea. <laughs> <laughs> awesome, awesome. So that's good. And now Diddy and Cassie mm. have broken up after 11 years. Honey, it's awful. Honey. I, well, I guess it is true. Yeah. I well, mean, I think that's a horrible situation. Yes. You give someone 11 years of your life yes. and you can't get no ring out the deal or no baby? Lord. But if, uh, wait a minute. You're trying to seal the uh -oh. deal. Wait a minute. <laughs> I know. I'm just saying, like, that 11 she was years pregnant. pregnant. Someone no. reported. Wasn't she, it reported she, she, that she yeah, was pregnant? Yeah, I heard she was not pregnant. I heard that she was, too. Yes. What? Yes. 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 I'm breaking new tea to me. Yeah. 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 It was. And uh -huh. when what? I saw that they had broken up, I was like, how did that happen with a yeah. new child possibly on the way? This I don't is know what's going to be true, tea. but wow. That's yeah. what I heard. Yeah, listen, yeah. Sister Circle, y'all breaking me some new <laughs> <too>? <laughs> <laughs> I'm all for it. Well, let's talk about Cardi B twerking at the Hip Hop Awards. What do you think about that? I mean, if she wants a proper booty, honey, she's a freak. Let her do it. Oh, oh. it was so <laughs> much, though. Hey, right. listen, she got it right there. If you want to sit there and pop that thing. I mean, she's a past stripper, so I mean, like, yeah, that's uh, true. What do you mean? Like, is, this, is something wrong with it? Like, if she wants to sit there and clap and pop and twerk, I think you, if you gotta do it. Well, wow. I, I gotta tell you, I didn't really care for it much. I love the first part of the performance. I good. thought she did her thing. It, it empowered women. I, I love that she had all of the ladies there yeah. in Army Fatigue pop, and I, I thought that was great. Uh, the second part, not so much, and I'll tell you why. I don't mind her doing a twerking or whatever. It is what it is. You know, it, that's a part of the culture of this day. However, I did not like that man standing over her like that's that. That's why I did. Well, well, I mean, me you know, also popped it in like that also. I did not so. like it. But then again, I think it's I mean, the it's performance. performance, so yeah. therefore, yeah. If you want to give your all a performance and she wants to twerk, I mean, that's what Cardi's known for. That's You have to go with put you on in the game. Yeah. Like, she got put on being herself, and if that is exactly who herself, I don't think she should change up for anybody. Wow. Yeah, I awesome. agree, but I think she should have had Offset come out and do the whole thing. Still should have came out and been the one. Yeah. And then he just wanted to see Offset, I think. Yeah, just want to see Offset yeah. come down. <laughs> yeah. 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 I get it. Well, Rock, what do you think about Kim and Kanye going to Uganda? What's up I with mean, that? Because you've interviewed with them before. Yeah, well, not yeah. Kim, but Kanye, Kanye. yes. He's yeah. actually going to be on my show. OK, cool. So, oh, nice. Yeah. How'd, you, uh, what, how'd that interview go? I got a thousand questions. What's oh, good? Oh, honey, it went good. So <laughs> honestly, you think that it got a little tricky, but it didn't. Mm -hmm. Kanye was super cool, like, he gives me some tea, uh -huh. and he's just being himself and being real, so okay. I appreciate that. Uh -huh. And as far as them going to Uganda, I think that if, as long as it's not for, like, anything other than helping out mm -hmm. and doing humanitarian work and giving back, then I think that's a good thing. Uh -huh. yeah. There's nothing wrong with someone helping out a whole country and giving back, right. and especially bringing for tourism. He plans on, he gave shoes, the Yeezys, so uh -huh. therefore that's a good well, what thing. What do you think about this Make America Great Again and this rant that he went um, on and on and on about at the White House? Oh, no, I'm not with the Amer Make America Great mm -hmm. Again, no. Like, Just I'm not wondering. with it at all. I think that's horrible. Mm -hmm. But I think that he did also... A lot of people are taken away. He did also ask for certain things mm -hmm. that do matter, though, like for as far as gangs, jobs in Chicago, and, and wanting Larry and Hoover to and, be released. And, uh, free Larry Hoover, I'm all mm -hmm. with it, mm -hmm. like a thousand percent. So I think that some of his message, so. though, he did go passing out a good thing. I think mm -hmm. a lot of people just go for the bad and mm -hmm. just jump onto that, but. Mm -hmm. Not me, like, as far as him, like, oh, should you make America great again? No, I'm not with any of Donald Trump's annex. Correct. Mm -hmm. But I am with, as far as if you also do want to pass on a message mm -hmm. to make positivity what? happen, then yes. And I agree with you on that, but I think what happened, the message got lost, mm -hmm. in a sense. It got drowned it out. Of course. I think that's exactly what happened. Well, but, you know what? Let's switch gears and yeah. talk about you and your show. Yes! Yes! yes. yes. Cause um, that's what's 
important here, girl. Yeah. 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 It's yeah. 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 And it's Let me wreck rants. Let me do it for the rants. culture one time. Yes. 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 And it's whack rants. Right. It's on rack BET. Rack rack BET, rack rack October 23rd, yes. Tuesday, 11 p.m. And what can we expect from rack rants? Every Tuesday after that, so make sure you tune in. You can expect me being real, authentic. Clearly. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> not playing no games yes. down to the table. Exactly. So, and then the interviews, though, they're very fun. I go to multiple locations, nothing mm -hmm. scripted. So, whatever I think of the top of my head, that's what I'm going to ask you. Let right. me ask you a question, yeah. though. When you're interviewing um, these A-listers and you're in, in the midst of talking to them and you're reporting their stories, do you ever feel inside like, you know, there's a level of decorum that I should possibly have? And what is your, mm -hmm. um, how you this balance is too that. much? Yeah. And, this no, is you enough. know what? I'm probably too much a lot. So, okay. <laughs> <laughs> the radar is probably very high. Yeah. Then I'll just go and ask whatever is mm -hmm. on the top of my head and I'll think about it later. Like, damn, Raquel, you shouldn't have done that. Right. <laughs> right. Right. But um, I think that the level is, as long as you're being respectful, mm -hmm. so I always definitely try to do that, but sometimes they may get a little tricky. Right, yeah. right. But, Right. Other than that, it's... But it's long as it's respect. Yeah. You gotta keep it real, though. For people who don't know, and we saw you pop up on TMZ, give us the 30 second of how you even got into this whole lane, mm -hmm. because you're mm -hmm. you're killing it. Yes. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, no, Harvey honestly gave me my, with my YouTube show. Mm -hmm. So from there, my YouTube was a big deal, and it went very well. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it went viral, and I broke a lot of stories on that. Mm -hmm. And then BET, they offered me a chance, and I'm like, wow. oh, well, thank you. Yeah. So yeah. it's right. actually a collaboration between Harvey and BET. Oh, okay. Ooh, so okay. you'll still be able to do both? Yes, I yeah. am. I'm going to double check. You got oh. yeah, right? Bag, bag, bag. Because yours is going up right now. Yes. <laughs> Please, you, we want you to know this is an open door policy. We yes, would love to have yes, you back. Anytime please. you want to dish some more tea, oh, yes. you, can and you guys are me tea, so we're doing collaborative. Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> okay, you can catch Rack Rest Tuesday nights at 11 10 Central.